and we welcome you to another super funny video. Today's video, we're going to be talking about, today's video, we're going to be talking about the new host of MMA Wrestling. Some of you guys are probably saying, yeah, yeah, I'm waiting for this video because I follow the Mike Tuber page on Instagram. You know, it's going to be awesome. What's the new host? And a lot of you guys are probably saying, what is the freaking host of MMA Wrestling? You know, so let, let's go ahead and explain what the host of MMA Wrestling is. Right now, I'm the host of MMA Wrestling, and I will always be the voice of MMA Wrestling. I will always be the manager of MMA Wrestling. Whenever... Whenever, whatever happens to be wrestling will be under my cause. But, you know, I'm the host. And I made I made him be wrestling in 2013. You know, I made it, like, just a few months after my October was made. You know, um, you know, and the, right now I'm the current host. And what I do is I throw, on the, I throw action figures around this room every Sunday. I commentate on the announcers and I make the superstars say words. And I'm like, oh my God, Michael, it's a great Aunt JR. Oh my God, Michael, Hans Fawns is awesome. You know, like, you know, it's, I like doing it, but I'm almost 16 years old. This October, I'll be 16. And it's just like, I feel like, how am I going to grow up? How am I going to, you know, how am I going to, like, I'm fixing to start. I'm fixing to start a job, you know, when I turn sixteen in October. Like, I can't do a job and throw action figures around the room. I need to grow up a little bit. So, I can't end MMA wrestling. That will never happen. So I figured, why not make a new host? And the new host will be, you know, Xavier. That's the best option for me because he's funny. You know, MMA wrestling will now be like. What do you say, Jr. Bruh, this is gonna be awesome, bro. You know, like you know, however he says it, it's gonna be amazing. I can't wait till he does it. But you know, like I said, guys, Xavier, I will tell him. Listen, man, make so and so fight, make so and so win by this way. And, you know, and if he wants to like, get a title change, he's like, yo, man, I want right front to be the champion. Can I change it? And if I don't want right front to be a champion, I'll say, no, man, keep the belt on Dolph Biggs, okay? Keep the Emmy Wrestling World Heavyweight Stairway Champion on Dolph Biggs. All right, bruh, you know, like, you know, and if you want, like, so, see, because a lot of you guys love how I'm doing MB Wrestling. A lot of you guys, a lot of you guys have been direct messaging us. A lot of you guys have been messaging me on Instagram and Twitter and saying, I love how you're doing MB Wrestling. You know, you have Rye Front, Doth Biggs, and Daniel Stein in a, th you know, kind of like a triple threat, you know, storyline. I love it. You know, now that I'm, now I'm like, you know, kind of like, now that I'm kind of like, you know, letting Xavier do it, a lot of you guys are probably, a lot of you guys are probably scared, like, you know, so it's a story, the story is still going to continue, like, how I'm doing, nothing's really going to change in the wrestling, nothing's going to change, it's just, you know, you're going to have a different voice, you're going to have, instead of this voice, like, oh my god, it's going to be, welcome to the wrestling, you're going to have, welcome to the wrestling, Brah. you know, how, you know, Xavier's, you know, voice, you know, and then, you know, It'll still be my mind doing it. I'm, it it's going to be like, Xavier's moving my mind. I'm going to tell Xavier, okay, man, listen. Make sure Daniel Stein flies. Make sure right front. Make sure he flies. And while he's flying, make him say, right front is going to kill you. You know, it's, you won't even notice. Like, if you if you turn down the volume on Xavier's voice on Sundays, it'll still be pretty much like me doing it. It's just going to be Sunday, Xavier. You know, I'm going to tell Xavier, I'm going to call him. I'm going to say, listen, man. I'm going to call Xavier every Sunday, make sure you do this, make sure you do that, make sure you do this, and he's going to do it. He's gonna, he, he, if you don't do it, I'm coming back to me wrestling. Listen, guys, I hope you guys enjoy me wrestling this time, you know. I, like I said, I'm still going to be doing me wrestling, but, you know, it's, I won't be doing the throwing, I won't, I won't be touching the action figures, and I should be playing with them anymore, you know. I'll be at Xavier's job, but I'm going to I'm gonna be like, okay, Xavier, do that, do this, because I'm just, I'm getting older, I, I don't, I... I can't be, I can't be, I can't be 16 and throw an action figure in my room. I, just, I can't do that. I'm not going to do that. You know, listen guys, I love you guys so much. I'm very passionate about this. I'm very passionate about Mike Tuber. But, you know, it's just, I'm, I'm getting older. I'm getting older and I just, I can't throw action figures around anymore. I, just, I can't do that anymore. I just, I can't, you know, but Xavier will do it. And it's, you know, like I said, it's not going to be me doing it. But Xavier's going to be playing with the action figures. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you guys later.